Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today we're playing a new game, Haunt. A game where you're under under a town or something, in an underground town, and you have to escape. I'm not completely sure how it works. I've never played this game before ever, but it looks really good and I think it's pretty popular. You see down here, it has a 90% like rating, so you know, I, I figured that I would play it. Also guys, we have this new background over here. I added some lead lights and got my bean back. <laughs> yeah, I think this is pretty good. I my old places, I don't they weren't amazing. Like I was in the van and I just I just didn't really like it. Like there was too much sun and shining through, there was too much dust and just wasn't really my thing. But we, we finally have this and it's perfect and I'm very thankful for it. So yeah, it's great. So over here, if we look around, we have like, it looks like we have some swings. Like, this looks like a playground gone wrong. We have, like, a huge room full of swings and then, like, hell or or uh, something. Like, these are some dark red clouds. And then right here, this looks like the eye from Lord of the Rings. Like, that one eye that, if you if you put the ring on, I, I think I remember there being, like, an eye that's, that the ring, that's on the ring. Yeah. And that's exactly what it looks like right here. If you stare directly at it for too long, then you're done. Don't stare at it for too long, or else you're, you'll die. It's that simple. And then we have a robot right here. I don't know if this robot is good or bad. I don't know what its intentions are, or if, if it even is a robot. Maybe I could be mistaken. But I know that this is probably bad. Like, I'm pretty positive that this is going to be bad. So, yeah. Also, this looks like Seek from Doors. Like, in Roblox Doors, and that one part where the big, the big monster, he stands up, he gets out of the ground, and he has that huge one eye. That looks like, exactly like Seek's eye. Like, a lot like his eye. And... What's the description say? Play this horror game alone or with your friends. Hop on a tram and venture into this underground town to get out alive. That is, if you can. You'll need care, courage, perseverance, and use each death as a lesson. Okay, I am going to be needing to use each death as a lesson because I have no idea what's going to happen. What about the imagery over here? Like, I see, like, a, a dancing skeleton in gold. Like, that's funny. We have a, a skeleton dressed in gold, and it's going, like, you know, ugh, all that action. All that action. You know, I don't even know. I could be 100% wrong right now. I could be 100% goofing around. Anybody who has actually played this game, they could be they could be saying that I'm I'm just being dumb right now, but it looks like a, a skeleton with like a gold helmet and gold armor and it looks like it's dancing. Looks like it's, it's doing some dance moves. <laughs> yeah, that's hilarious. If that was actually how it was, that would be hilarious. Cause I have no idea what this game is about. Anyway guys, let's go ahead and start playing the game. This looks awesome. This game contains loud noises, flashing lights, and jump scares. For the best experience, wear headphones. Okay. So this is going to tell us how to play. That's cool. Up on a tram to launch a run. Throughout your run, you'll find items that you can either use yourself in runs or keep. And once back in the lobby, put up for a sale by interacting with the merchant. Your objective is... Wait, where am I? Oh. Your objective is to escape from this underground town while resisting all of the entities you will encounter. It will be far from easy, and you'll have to learn from your mistakes to perhaps finally succeed. Okay. The 
boost guide at the lobby or in certain rare areas during your run, you'll see boosts of other players. And these you will be able to buy directly from players. Oh, whatever, whatever. They're telling me about coins. Okay. Okay, that's probably nothing important. Okay, so we have this entire town. Famous last words. I know you guys are thinking. <laughs> Nothing important, you know? It's always important. That's how it always is, you know? You can't just ignore stuff like that. But I'm, I don't think that was anything. Okay. All right, we have seven seconds left until departure. Oh, I am excited, guys. I'm really excited for this game. I can't wait to see what this is about. Cram departure. On the way, good luck. Okay, so this is cool because indoors, the way you leave is through an elevator. In pressure, you leave, leave through a submarine. And in this, you leave through, quite frankly, I don't even remember or even notice what it even was that we left through, but it looked like some sort of elevator or door or something, but it's cool. You know, the way that we exit in video games on Roblox is just cool for some reason. I don't know why. I don't know how much anybody else notices that, but I, I think it's cool. Okay, what do we have here? Backpack, tap. Okay. Don't know, I don't really know. Oh, there we go, it's light again. Okay, perfect. Oh, yeah, so I think we're in an elevator. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What is going on? Guys, I am 100% new to this game. I don't know what to do. Hello? Hello? Gosh, you're here! I'm- I'm Timmy, and I've been working- hiding here ever since entities began haunting the town. Uh-uh. Now that the tram's broken down, we have to cross the whole town to get out. Oh. Oh, wow. Then don't waste any time, it's time to go! Okay. So I assume you're gonna help me, or... You're just gonna sit there? Hmm, I see, we have to move forward until we find the exit? Okay. I should be able to find my way. The workers always left a number on the walls, okay. So we have to look for numbers, right? Okay, whoa, okay, so you're, you're coming with me, right? I hope you are, because I have no idea what I'm doing, and I don't know if you do either, to be honest. Okay, so, I think we're just searching for items around, trying to look for s stuff. <laughs> uh, anything in here that, that's useful? Oh, we got some coins, nice. Okay, yeah, this, this does give me some Dorg vibes. Oh, I need more coins, okay. Well, I'm glad that this doesn't all cost Robux. Everything seems to cost Robux in these games. But anyway... Yeah, we need a key, don't we? We need a key. Okay, yeah, we're just searching around for... Oh, we found a main key. Perfect. Okay, before I leave, we're just gonna look for anything inside the barrels. There's always something. You can't miss anything. Anything? Anything? Okay, oh, coin, okay. I don't think there's much in these barrels other, other than coins, okay. So, let's go. I don't know what he said about number, though. Number on the walls. Oh, we have 80. Okay. 80. I guess, I don't know if that's important for me to memorize, but okay. Let's just go straight to it now. Whoa. Hey, you coming? Come on! Come on, don't, don't leave me here by myself. 
I'm a complete noob. I don't know what to do. All right. We're going to look around again. So this is where I hide. And I assume I'm going to be having to notice something. It's something I have to notice before I hide places, right? Just like in doors. Just like in any other game like this. Okay. I don't even know what it is yet. Like in doors, it was flickering lights. That was obvious. But I have no idea what I'm supposed to hide from right now. So if that ever happens, I, I really hope it doesn't happen. That would be bad. Oops, I wasn't trying to do that. Okay. Wait, what's the, what's over here? Is there anything over there? I don't see anything. Um, what have we got? Okay, I assume we just keep going. Hey, uh, little gremlin guy, where are you? Gremlin! Gremlin man! Gremlin man, come on! Okay, there we go. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Alright. So we're just gonna keep traveling through the caves. Nothing, nothing important happening right now, I guess. I don't know where the number was on that room. Oh, some coins. Nice. We got 15 coins. So, if we have enough coins, we'll be able to buy stuff. Okay. That's, that's good to know. Okay, so, we're gonna open- wait, wait. Oh, I didn't even have time to look at the number. I don't know what number I'm trying to find. I don't know what to do. Okay. Well then, I guess let's just look around for uh, some more scrap or something. Find some scrap. Whoa, 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 okay. I'm getting lost in the darkness a little bit, aren't I? Okay. Coins, yes. Okay, we're getting, we're getting pretty rich. In doors, the way to get rich was digging your hands in the hotel drawers, but in here, it's digging in the cave barrels. Either way, making lots of money, getting a living. Okay, we found another key. I don't know where our gremlin man is right now. Hey gremlin, are you lost? Are you lost, gremlin? Where is gremlin man? Gremlin man, where are you? I can't do this without you. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, okay. So, we just gotta keep going this way. And I assume there's a place we have to open with a key, right? Oh, I'm traveling in the void, aren't I? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Okay, we got our door right here. Perfect. Okay, okay, okay. Alright. Okay. Everything's fine, I hope. Isn't it? Right? Alright. Nothing over here. Whoa, okay, so it seems like there's some kind of storm going on, just like in doors. Some kind of rushing sound I keep hearing. I hope that's nothing I have to go hiding, too. I really hope not. Okay, well, I think we need another key, so we already checked these barrels. Um, where have we not checked yet for keys? I have no idea. Okay, so... Oh, I haven't even been using my lantern. <laughs> I, I didn't even notice I had a lantern for some reason. I just wasn't even paying attention. Well, actually, I noticed, but I for some reason I wasn't using it. I don't know why. Okay, well, since there's nothing over there, I guess we just keep going this way. Whoa, 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 <laughs> whoa, you're not gonna, you're not gonna do that, are you? Okay, I wanna I wanna conserve the battery for my lantern, but it's also getting pretty dark. Like I know that I'm gonna need this. I know I'm gonna need my lantern at some point. Okay, so anything in here? Nope. Coins? Yes. Nice.
All right, so there's so much stuff, so many things to get. Oh my, okay. Anything we have not checked out yet. There's gotta be a key somewhere around here. Okay, but we have a hundred coins, yeah! Yeah, we have a hundred coins now, so we should be able to buy some more useful stuff if we ever encounter it again. I don't know if it's in the game. I, I, I feel like I saw it in the game. I'm not sure. I, like, before the game, or maybe sometime in the game. I don't remember when it was. But, I'm still looking for this key. I have no idea. Oh, oh, we don't need a key for this door? Oh, okay. Nice. I still got lots of coins, which is nice. Okay. I love how there's a little gremlin that just helps you go through these these places. I don't he didn't even introduce himself to me. I I don't even remember him introducing himself to me. Oh, nice. We have a house. We need to find the red house key. Yeah, that's pretty obvious at this point. Games don't just let you walking around in random houses. You got to have a key, brother. You gotta have a key. Oh, I have the red house entrance key. Nice. I found a flashlight as well. I found a flashlight. Wait, did I get the flashlight? Oh, I have it in my backpack. Okay, so. Flashlight, backpack, key. Alright, let's try entering this house. What is inside this house? Whoa. Whoa. Okay. It's already looking pretty cool. And let's try going up this ladder. Whoa. 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 Okay, so is there nothing up there? Is there anything up there I could do? Or, oh, it's on this side. Okay. So I got it on this side. Anything up here useful? We got some coins, nice. We got a place we can hide in. Okay, I still have no idea what we're hiding from. Like, no idea. And I assume our gremlin man does not want to enter this house. Okay, that's fine. Where even is gremlin man right now? Where did gremlin man go? Gremlin, oh, there you are, okay. I bet he was looking for me, not me looking for him. Is there any barrel we haven't opened yet? I don't think so. Maybe these ones over here? I don't think we opened these. I kind of want to find the other keys, though. Because I'm curious of what's inside. Or maybe it's just other coins. Maybe not. I don't know. Anyway, I, I'm going to keep going. Wherever the gremlin man just went, he needs, to, he needs to come with me. Where did he go? Oh, well. I'm just gonna keep going. Oh, this is the wrong way. Oh no, okay, so that means I need to hide, isn't it? Where am I gonna hide? No! Oh my goodness, hide, hide! That would mean I have to hide, right? Whoa, no! 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 Guys, I thought I thought I was supposed to get out. I thought that meant like, bro, you're staying too you're staying in too long. You gotta get out. You gotta get out, man. But it turns out I was wrong. And it's much too fast. It's useless to run away from it. It comes when the lights flicker. Okay, well it's good to know that it happens when the lights flicker because you never know. And their name is Raven. Okay, we got Chase, we got Raven. I don't know what the pressure one was called, but... Okay, let's play again, I guess. 
Guys, it turns out I was being dumb. He actually did introduce myself himself to me. I just forgot what his name was. Okay, his name is Timmy. Timmy. Okay. Tim. Oh, but what is that? A bird? No, a raven? I don't know. <laughs> Oh, so yeah, so there are ravens rushing by. Whenever whenever the lights flicker, that means the ravens are gonna come and we have to move. Which is cool. We got we got our ravens coming out. Guys, hashtag respect your ravens. <laughs> respect your ravens, guys. Ravens are good birds and they mean no harm. Just don't bother them, okay? Don't bother them. Okay. Okay, we found the little house entrance key. We're in a new spot now. Cool. Nothing inside here. At least I don't think. Does that mean I have to hide again? I don't think so. I think we're good. They're just doing that to scare me. In every single horror game, they're always going to play some sort of noise or like, do I gotta do this? And, you know, they're just trying to scare you. Stop. Don't be fooled. Alright, there's so many different keys that I just keep finding. Is there anything actually useful inside of them besides coins? Like, you don't want to miss anything, but you don't want to waste time. Oh, I found a battery! Nice! Okay. Well, that tells me maybe there is something up here. Nope, there isn't. Oh, whoa, we found a bunch of coins. <laughs> Wow, that's nice. We're, we're getting close to 200 points. Maybe next time we can buy some more useful stuff. Because we're getting lots of money. And we just we reached our goal of 200. Nice. Okay. We're making it far in this game. I don't know how many doors there are. I'm, I'm assuming there's probably like 100. But knowing the mysterious, of, mysterious nature of these games, anything is possible. Literally anything is possible. Okay, we're going downhill this time. Got some coins, nice. And we need another key, which is very obvious. It's just gonna be right here, isn't it? Yep, there we go. If only I known, had known what was going to happen. I can't erase your problems, but I hope these coins will help you. Oh, oh, it's okay, Gremlin. I don't even know what uh, Tema actually did. I just feel like I don't know what he did though. What did he do? Okay, so this is a place where we can buy some stuff. Heal lightly. Oh, there we got lots of stuff to buy. Nice. What else do we have? We have a, just a key. <laughs> oh, look. There are eyeballs? Whoa. Okay, this is dark, isn't it? Alright, what else do we got around here? We got a flashlight. Maybe I'll get a flashlight. Flashlights would actually be helpful. Flashlight. <laughs> they spelled it wrong. Flashlight. Okay, guys, I just want to say, whenever I see any misspellings at any time, I look on my keyboard and I see, are those letters close to each other? So, the bad, they, 
they've just added a random C. And C. Uh, C. Okay, it's a little bit close to the G, but <laughs> okay, that's fine. No big deal. Hmm, okay, so how do I buy? Do I have enough coins? It says 15, but they're not letting me buy it, aren't they? So, I guess not. What about over here? Health potion, okay. Health potion. Why is our, our goblin Tema here? Like, what is this? What in the world is that? That is weird. There's gotta be some kind of backstory about why he'd be sleeping there, or maybe there's- he's just there. I don't- I don't know. That's weird. Oh, I feel like I was searching the wrong way, maybe. Maybe I was just searching the wrong way. I honestly don't know where I am. Okay, so that since these barrels are un unopened, I think I was just searching. Did you hear the rat? Talk to Timmy or hide. What? What? Ask help. Caught red handed. What? Dodge rat. I just wanted to know if you had a little thing to eat. <laughs> what? Oh my goodness. Okay, so I actually managed to dodge the rat. Wow, that's cool. That's cool. So there's an evil rat on us. Not just ravens, but there's also evil rats. Whoa. We need to find a blue house key. Of course you do. Okay. I don't think there's anything in there, though, that's useful other than coins and stuff. So I'm going to keep going. Okay, so my flashlight is almost out of power, though, so I'm gonna have to charge that pretty soon. What was that crunching sound? I thought I heard something. Also, Tim A must, must think I'm so dumb for going all that way for so much time. Because I actually had no idea where I was, and I was so confused, but it's actually working, so that's fine. Okay, wait. Was that a light flicker? I think we're good for now. Okay, wow, we're in a new place. This is cool. Whoa, that, that's amazing. Okay. I love this game so much. Okay, so we have these barrels. And I guess th this doesn't need a key, so that's nice. Or is there anything inside? No, I don't think there's anything over here.
Alright guys, I like that game a lot. It was a lot of fun, and I might actually make a part two for it sometime. Because that was amazing. That was great. And maybe I'll continue on. I'm really curious of what else there actually is in this game. So, chances are there will be a part two. Who knows? This was so cool. Like, shout out to the developers. That was amazing. Who even developed this game? Like, I wonder if they have any other cool games I could possibly play. We have... B-L-M-I-N-D-S. Blim... B-L Minds. Bacon Lettuce Minds. <laughs> okay, this person loves bacon lettuce tomato sandwiches. I, I'm sure they do. They're pretty good if you take those tomatoes away. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you guys next time.